Take me back to that day in August. It's about 10 o'clock in the morning, normal day, and all of a sudden... We heard a crash. And when further investigation from the girls in the department, we realized a doctor's, a car came through the doctor's lounge there. And your office is right next to her? Our office is three windows down, yeah. So what did you do? Um, we jumped up to see what was on the go, of course. Um, one girl called the code. Myself and Deanne Tans ran out, and I was, I was the first one. I reached in and turned off the car as the occupant in the car couldn't turn it off. So why did you feel it was important to turn off the car? I mean, was there anything else happening? Janet noticed that the gas tank must have been punctured and was leaking gas, and the car was still in drive, so we had to turn it off to prevent further destruction. And uh, were you concerned at all for your own safety? What was in your mind when you ran in to do that? Um, just that the car had to be turned off. It was just instinct that it had to be done, and I guess where I was the first one there, I turned it off. And uh, it could have been a lot worse, I gather. Yeah, if the fire department said if the gas reached where the spinning tires, it probably would have ignited. So it probably would have been an explosion of some sort. And the tires were actually still spinning? The car was actually still in drive when I shut it off. I was, you think about it every day, what could have been, that kind of thing, but it's just something that it had to be done, and I guess I was there, and I did it. Well, thank you so much for your, your quick action and, and certainly your, your bravery. Thank you.